Greetings to my viewers on the MCHTV2 channel. Today, I decided to take on the challenge of eating a spicy chip without drinking anything for 10 minutes. This is indeed the spiciest chip, the hot chips challenge. I will attempt to eat it without drinking this milk, which I have in this carton. And here it is. Maybe it's not the first time I'm opening the box because I've opened it before, to see what the package contains. And so, in the package, we will find. Here's a coffin with an inscription. A gift card for percentage discounts. A sticker of the spiciest chip hashtag hot chip challenge. A sticker of the spiciest chip hashtag hot chip challenge. The text is in English. This spiciest chip. Here on my screen at the top, you will have a screenshot of time passing for 10 minutes after eating the chip. Imposed during the editing of this video. But I will set it to 10 minutes on my second phone as well. A 10 minute timer. which I will start from eating this spiciest chip. I'm undertaking this action right now. And if that's not enough for me, I'll show you that I have the two spiciest sauces with me. Wait a moment, editing time. Here come these two spiciest sauces. This is sriracha sauce, which I really like and use, as you can see, it's empty. And the new volcano sauce, also spicy. If this sauce isn't spicy enough for me. Now, let's do as they write and say on the internet. I will try to eat this chip with gloves on. So I'll eat it the same way with gloves on. So I'll eat it the same way with gloves on. This is what the chip looks like. The smell is not the spiciest. It's like that. This is what it looks like up close. Very thin. In case of W, I'll pour some milk. Now I feel a little tingle in my nose. And as you can see, I'm pouring milk. If I need to ease the heat, but I'll try to break the record without drinking. If I need to ease the heat, but I'll try to break the record without drinking. So let's measure ourselves. A bit tough. The punch isn't that strong.
Oh, c'è un mimo bene. I won't touch the milk. It's better now. I'll change the camera angle so you can see. For a moment, I had hiccups, spiciness, and teary eyes. My speech was cut off. But it's better now. Only three minutes have passed, not even two minutes and 45 seconds. Since taking the chip and eating it. No, the hiccups have passed. As I said, I like spicy, so... So. I'll add some spiciness. It cut off my speech. But it's not that bad. My lips are a bit chapped. According to my spiciness scale. I would give it a six. I've eaten spicier pizza before. But I won't promote the pizzeria on my channel. Where I sweated, felt, and rated it a strong 8 out of 10. But here I'm giving it only a 6. Because I only had a momentary hiccup and burning sensation, but it's slowly subsiding as you can see. I still have milk poured. And I haven't even consumed it yet, and it's already been 5 minutes and 18 seconds. And there's no such tragedy. I've already survived the worst. I managed to survive here. I'll drink the milk once these agreed upon 10 minutes pass. I can handle it. 
Now I know what this chip tastes like. It's corn-based, more like a seasoned chip. At first bite, it hits you. It's intense, but when you're accustomed to spicy food and know how to react, it doesn't create a big shock. And I'm not sweating too much. Just an average chip. It's mildly spicy for me. It was bearable. I don't have any more bread here, but as you can see, sriracha sauce can still come to the rescue. No problem. And thanks for a hundred likes on the previous video because if you're watching this video where I eat the spiciest chip and he's sipping sriracha and volcano sauce without drinking milk, it means you gave a hundred likes on the previous video. Straight into the mouth, just like that. I know I may have bad teeth, but you can live with it. I recommend it to anyone who wants to challenge themselves with this chip. As you can see on the screen, it's already 7 minutes and 50 seconds. And I'm not drinking milk. Only spicy sauces keep coming in. It's like that. I would handle something spicier. Still mine. My body's reaction that momentarily left me speechless. But because there was a large amount of SHU, Scoville heat units, although the manufacturer doesn't specify how much SHU is in this chip, nowhere can you read that. Not on any sheet here, but you eat it at your own risk. It's not that bad. Anyone can give it a try. So, to create another challenge with a spicy chip, I'd like to nominate. One person or even exactly two people from my company where I work who will be watching. If they are watching, David and Igor. It's David and Igor from Ukraine. The individuals who are watching this video will know who I am talking about. David T. David and Igor. I don't want to provide surnames in the video, of course, due to GDPR. I can still provide the first name and initial of the last name. David T. and Igor. I invite you all to take part in this challenge. In needing this chip, you're so clever. And you will survive. If I manage to do it. You're hearing it right now. Ten minutes have passed. I'm stopping the stopwatch. Now, it's been 10 minutes since eating the chip. I can finally drink milk. Just like that. So that I can finally feel something cold. And I would eat more of these chips. Thank you for sticking with me to the end of this video. Let's have some milk together for good health.
dziękuję za oglądanie filmu. And thank you for watching the previous video and giving it over 100 likes. I and for sharing both that video and this one. It was spicy, but not too spicy. Now, next time, I'm going for even spicier things. I just need to find and hunt something in the store. See you in the next spicy video. On my channel. Regards from MCHTV2.